What's up guys, it's the boy Young Guy. I'm back for another food review. Today we are at Vince's Pizzeria. Uh, we're over at the one in Fishtown. So they got three, actually they got one in Fishtown, one in Newtown. Uh, the one in Newtown also has a bar um, or a beer wall. And then they've got one on Grant Ave. The Grant Ave one is the original. So if you guys have been to the original um, and not the Fishtown one, make sure you stop in at the Fishtown one. We got some pepperoni pizza. We got the white spinach garlic. We got cheese pizza. And then we got the red pepper cheese steak stromboli. I guess I'm gonna start with the pizza because it's pizza month. Mm. Thin crust, again, not my favorite style, but can't judge a pizza by its cover. Pretty good pie. It's not all that doughy, which I like. I would say we're dealing with a little bit of a sweeter sauce. Real good crisp on the dough though, which I enjoy that. So I feel like it's a pretty flaky pie. Love that as well. Good ratios, well balanced. It's more of a, it's a traditional pep slice for me. Nothing over the top, but it'll get the job done if you're hungry. If you want a personal pie, go with the pep. Number? Six nine. I don't think it's a crazy pepperoni slice, but it's still a good pepperoni slice. It's around average, at least in my opinion. The white spinach garlic slice. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Fresh chopped spinach, shredded mozz, garlic sprinkled with grated cheese and oil. Mm. I like that. It's a little oily, but I still like that. Mm. Mm hmm. This is a nice little play from the pepperoni, honestly. It's, it's kind of a twist for me, a real change up. I'm here for it though. Yeah. I haven't tried the stromboli yet. Uh, yeah. Once we got no flop. It's a light sauce. I mean, a light slice. Smell just tasting pretty fresh. I like it more than the pepperoni, honestly. I'd, I'd recommend this slice. Off the ones I've tried so far, uh, the two, this is my favorite. Seven four. I think all the ingredients combined really well. This slice wasn't as oily either. Mm. 
I would say as far as flavor goes, I think the cheese is my least favorite. But I think it's just because it's plain and it has no pizzazz. And the dough isn't really, you know, the dough and the, the tomato sauce aren't really doing it any, any services here. I don't think the cheese is that great, guys. I mean, the cheese, I'd say about a 5.8. I think the cheese is a 5.8. I mean, it's just cheese. Like, there's nothing to talk about with it. it. Doesn't do anything fantastic. It's not all that special, in my opinion. Good dough, though. The sauce is all right. Wasn't a very stringy slice, so. Cheese here isn't really that ooey, that gooey in my opinion. They got three different size pizzas, or two different size pizzas, my bad. They got the small to large, small is 12 inches, large is 16. They got half whole strombolis. Unfortunately, they don't have cheesesteaks. That's the one thing I feel like missing off this menu. I'm excited to try the stromboli, so we got to get a few more bites in. Try that out. We're working with some steak, Cooper Sharp. You know how I feel about the Cooper Sharp. Red pepper oil, onions, and sauce. Doesn't look insane. Smells great though. We got a lot to break down with this stromboli. And quite frankly, I think it's pretty interesting. The steak is good. It's well done. Cooked to perfection. If you guys ever been to Fiesta, it was actually kind of reminds me of the cheesesteak pizza at Fiesta. And I'm a little bit conflicted because I think that, that pizza is good. I don't know if I think it's great though. I think it's the Cooper Sharp that's actually throwing me off a bit here. I've never done the Cooper Sharp in a Stromboli, only on a cheesesteak. It, it's kind of throwing me off a little bit. I don't like Cooper Sharp inside of products as much because sometimes when you let it sit a little bit, it kind of globs up. It doesn't taste like a cheesesteak. Honestly, I wouldn't say this is a cheesesteak Stromboli. It tastes like its own unique thing. Some red chili flakes would definitely hit on that. Give it a little bit of heat. I think that's what it's missing. Scoreboard? Let's give it a 6-9. I'm pretty sure. Let me get another bite. Yeah, 6 9 is fair. It's nice, it's crispy, but it's just missing something to put it over the top or make me really love it. Maybe a little bit of heat, which they do have hot honey, by the way. So if you love your hot honey, try it out. Yeah. 
Josh, how's it going to be it? For the video? We out of here, baby. <laughs> we got a lot here. We got pepperoni pizza. We got 